Hey fragrance fans, Fangirl here. Welcome to my channel. I hope you're all doing well, feeling and smelling fabulous. Today I have a sort of a hodgepodge video for you. We had a 40% off sale at Bath & Body Works and I was on the hunt for some goodies. I got a fantastic deal on some candle holders, so we'll check that out. Um, but also sort of a sad story. What I think is us Bath & Body Works fanatics, worst nightmare, broken bag. So we'll go over that story too. But I'm going to go ahead and jump right in to this little goodie bag I have here. I'm going to set it off to the side and reach in and show you guys what I got. So the first thing I picked up was some body care. And um, the sun is setting. I don't have very good lighting right now, guys. So forgive me for that. But... Here we go. Oops, that looks like it's been open. Hopefully nothing leaked. I don't think so. It's pretty clean. So before you, you see the blueberry sugar pancakes. I had this scent last year when it was all online exclusive and I love it. It is fantastic. The scent notes on blueberry sugar pancakes are sugared blueberries, fresh pancakes, and caramel cream drizzle. This is an amazing scent. Um, I know they're kind of marketing it for fall, but you could really wear this year round. It's just a foodie, gourmand, sugary, fruity, amazing scent. So I'm gonna refresh myself here with a quick sniff and it smells just like I remember. If you are a fan of wild berry jam donut, which happens to be in my top five favorite scents of all time, you will like this one. I know not many of you have experienced this yet since it was only an online exclusive last year, but I think it'd be safe to say if you are a foodie lover, if you are a fruity lover, if you like gourmand scents, if you like bakery scents, you're going to love this. It is sugary, decadent, sweet, yummy blueberries. It doesn't have a pancake note in the sense that it smells like maple. I do not like maple. Um, it's just too sickening sweet for me. It's too cloyingly sweet. I couldn't do the uh, pumpkin pecan waffles last year for that reason. Don't get me wrong, I enjoy the scent in Home Fragrance, even though it's kind of too strong for me even then, but in body care, just it was too much, guys. It's just that maple note turns me off, and I don't know why. Just too sugary sweet. So if you're not a fan of that, you will still like this. This does not have any maple in it. This is blueberry dessert. It is sugary blueberry and yumminess. I get like blueberry muffin vibes, blueberry pancakes, I guess, without the maple syrup, you know, blueberry um, a scone, blue any kind of blueberry bakery scent that's what you get here but with tons of sugar on top of those tart blueberries it's the perfect balance uh the raspberry jam donut very similar except take the raspberries out and have blueberries instead and then there's also not that powdered sugar note in here that the um wild berry or i'm sorry raspberry jam donut has this is more just sweet blueberries and it's fantastic i highly recommend it now I did go in stores because of the 40% off, 40 off sale. I did not pick up this body care at 40% off. This was an exchange for me. So I did have a set, a full set that I took back unused, unopened to exchange for the scent. So that's where that came from. And I just wanted to share that with you guys. I can't wait to use that. I'll probably crack into that late August, early September. So going back in the bag here, my next goodie, I found this on the 75% off table. It was a leftover from SAS, which they are now uh, re retitled as the summer sale. So anything left from semi-annual sale, guys, it, they're now just calling it the summer sale. And everything's pretty much clearanced from 50 to 75% off. So that's why I got this guy. Now, I didn't pick this up during any of the candle sales because I was iffy on it. Um, it smells really good, but I just wasn't, I wasn't cuckoo bananas for it. So I waited until I found it at 75% off. And the scent notes are fresh pineapple, milk chocolate, toasty marshmallows, and graham cracker. 
Um, I've had some bad luck with pineapple uh, scents recently, but this is, I think, gourmand enough where it will counter that sometimes really burnt, strange scent we get when we are um, burning pineapple wax, pineapple scented wax. This smells really good. It just smells like you get the pineapple, but the marshmallow tones down the acidity of it. And I don't get much chocolate, which I, I'm happy about. I'm not a huge, huge chocolate person um, as far as, you know, wax goes. I like it here or there, but it's hit or miss for me. So there's not a lot of chocolate here. The main thing my nose picks up is just the pineapple with that marshmallow that adds like a creaminess so it's like it really tones down the tartness of the pineapple it's nice so i'm excited to burn that one and that's the only candle i picked up at 75 percent off and the body care again was an exchange okay so moving on to the next thing this was the deal of all deals right here you guys you see these two boxes in front of you those of you who follow the community probably already know what this is um, and I did pick up two and I'm just going to grab one here and open it guys. Okay. Sorry about that guys. I went off camera to finish opening that box because it was giving me all kinds of issues, but I have opened it. And again, I'm just going to open one and show you guys what was inside. And here is what I got the pineapple candle holder. And you will not believe the price that I paid for this. These were marked down to $5.95. Yes, you heard me right. $5.95 for this three wick candle holder that originally retailed for $74.95. I could not believe it. When I went into store and I seen three of these on the shelf, they weren't even on the shelf, they were at the cash wrap. And there were three. And I seen the little tag they had hanging on it, the one of the take me home tags and the $5.95 price. And I asked the sales associate, is this accurate? She said, yes. And they had, she said, we got eight in the day before and somebody bought all eight. So I don't think that they're lasting long at that price point. I don't know if all stores are doing that price point, but I was flabbergasted. So there were three on the shelf or I'm sorry, three at the cash wrap, and I took two. I did leave one for someone else, so I plan on keeping one of these for myself, and I am going to gift one to a friend, and I just can't believe that I found this for $5.95. Let me know down below if you guys are getting any creep. I've never got a deal this good. I mean, I've seen it happen out there in the wild, we hear about things like that sometimes, but it's never happened to me. So I'm I'm just amazed. And this is beautiful. When it's turned on, it's just full of that gold. Uh, it's almost got like a iridescent. It's it's um it's so pretty. It's so glittery, and I'm just I'm in shock. If you can't tell that I was able to pick that up at that price point, I would have never bought that otherwise. I'm not a huge pineapple for, person as far as decor goes. But at that price, I'm going to use it and I'm going to love it. Put it out in the springtime with my um, pine toasted uh, pineapple marshmallow candle. And how great is that? So, yeah, I'm just, I'm still in shock at that deal, guys. So I did pick up two of those. Last but not least, I have a short story for you. Um, the 40% off sale, my goal was to find the Rainbow Hearts um pedestal candle holder, three-way candle holder. You guys, I would never pay full price um, for one of these. It's just, it's too much in my opinion. If you do, that's fine. I'm, I, you know, if you're happy and you're, you're able to afford it, then I'm happy for you. But I just can't justify spending like $75 on something like this. But if you get it on sale, then that is fantastic. But the Rainbow Hearts Pride pedestal candle holder, I've been looking at it and longing for it since it came out. And so when we had this random 40% off sale that we usually only get at Easter and Cyber Monday, Black Friday timeframe, 
when that popped up. And I think uh, Bath and Body Works, the strategic reason behind it, I think they were just trying to compete uh, with Amazon for Prime Day. But regardless, I was like, I'm getting my candle holder. So I didn't want to pay shipping. So I was looking around my area for the Bapas, the buy online, pick up in store. I checked 10 stores, you guys, and only two had it in my area. And one was really far and one was, you know, a little less than that. So I debated on whether I should just bite the bullet and pay shipping. But I'm like, no, I'm going to do an online order. So I placed an order at the, at the store that was closest to me that had it. And it wasn't even an hour later, I got that dreaded email that said, part of your order has been canceled. Well, that was the only thing I ordered, so I was really bummed. And I was like, well, I'll go online and order it and just pay the shipping, like I thought about earlier in the day. Well, by the time that that had all happened and they canceled my order, when I went online to the Bath & Body Work website, it was sold out. So my last hope was that one store that was really far away from me I took a chance, I got online, and it said they still had it in stock. So I was very excited. I placed the order. I said, yes, I will drive for this candle holder. I will go get it. And I did. So this is everything I picked up at that, at that store where I went to do my Bopis order. I picked up my Pride candle holder. I got these two guys at that fantastic price, $5.95. I did the exchange on this body care and I got the 75% off candle. The thing that you don't see here in front of you, the other holder was just wrapped in standard, you know, this type of wrap in the Bath and Body Works bag. And to hold all this, I had, they gave me one of these huge bags. Everything was in here, right? Carrying it into my house, our worst nightmare happened. Do you guys know what it is? So if you can see, both of my handles on my bag snapped. And it's my fault. I should have been supporting the bottom instead of relying on these candles because I did have both of these heavy boxes in there and a candle and the body care. So it was my fault, but I was just heartbroken because the one thing that wasn't wrapped well was my pride candle holder and it did break. So, you know, F's in the chat guys, but I'm gonna show it to you. Here she is, she is beautiful, she is glorious, but she is broken. So where it snapped at was right there at the base and I'm sure you can see the glue and this top piece that holds the candle snapped clean off from the bottom of the base so i was heartbroken but it sold out online none of the stores local to me have it so i was determined to fix it it was very sad you guys very sad but you know what it's got some character now um i'm not happy with the glue job as you can see or i don't know if you guys can see that you can see the glue there really was no getting around it because it had some little pieces. I don't know if this is resin or um, some kind of glass composite, but there are there were some chunks that just, you know, shattered. So it's not perfect, but you know what? My theory is if it's on a shelf, let me show you guys. If it's on a shelf, a little below eye level. No one is ever going to be able to see that. I will know it's there, but you can still admire the beauty of this piece, which I just, I love this. I absolutely adore this. I love the colors. I love the symbolism. I love like these 3D hearts, how they're like protruding, like the coming out of the base. And I love the gradient, the rainbow. It's so pretty. And it's got the like pearlized, these are almost like jewel tones, but they're so much more shiny because of that. Like whatever this coating is on the on this resin piece, it's it's beautiful. I am in love with it. So, like I said, if this is a little below eye level, you're never gonna be able to tell that it's broken and it gives it a little bit of character. So this is my only worry, you guys, is if it will hold though, because these candles are heavy from Bath & Body Works as if it will hold and it looks so far so good. This is the first time I've tried it out 
since we did the doctoring of it. And I think, I think we're gonna be okay. Hey, I'll keep an eye on it guys, trust me. When I'm burning something, you know, and I have hot wax and fire, I will keep a very close eye on this to make sure that nothing happens, but this might last. We'll see. So that's my story, guys. Um, and yeah, the, it's just beautiful on this uh, pineapple back there, too. But that's my haul. Again, sorry this video is a little all over the place. I just wanted to let you guys know what I got. This is kind of, I already did my sass wrap-up video. This is kind of little remnants left over of the sass slash slimmer sale. A little exchange I did on body care. But mainly it was that 40% off deal and I was going for this. And I got it and it broke, but I fixed it. And we're gonna love her anyway. So happy that I got happy that I got this at 40% off. And I did not even show you guys. It was $34.95. I think with the 40% off with the tax, I played I paid right around 20 bucks. So that's more reasonable. Um, definitely more reasonable than 35. So I really wanted this, so I picked it up. Love it. So sad that I broke it, but I'm still going to use it and hope for the best. These pineapple candle holders, my mind is still blown that I got them at that price. So I hope you guys were able to score some goodies with that 40% off sale. If you did, please let me know down in the comments what you were able to pick up. Did anyone else find like crazy deals on those pineapples? And what are you guys most excited for? for the fall and Halloween launches. I will be in stores Monday the 18th for our Halloween launch and I'm sure I'll have another haul and another story for you guys coming up. So if you're not subscribed, please click down below the red subscribe button. Join us over here for some fragrance fun. I'll have more content for you guys and we're gonna go on this autumn adventure together. It's my favorite time of year, I'm so excited. And again, let me know what you picked up for the 40% off sale. That was uh, that was quite a quite an event, quite a day, but you know, something new and different. Thanks guys for watching this video. I hope that you enjoyed it. I hope that you found it informative. And if you did, please subscribe, give it a like, and join my channel over here. I will again be having some more videos coming up, Halloween videos and fall videos, Bath and Body Works content, some other vendors. I have something else I was going to show you guys, but I'll save it for another video. So. Thanks guys for watching. Hope you have a wonderful day, night, week, weekend, whenever you're watching this. Thank you again. Talk soon guys.